Hey guys, Blamager here, and we're back with another episode of Let's Play Wonder Project J, Mechanical Boy Pino. And in the last episode, we taught him how to farm. This episode, who knows what this one was. Joshua, there's a sports meet being held at the Corlo Racetrack. There's a foot race, shot put, hole in one contest, and a free kick contest. For every contest won, you get prize money and a trophy. And the one who can win all four will be crowned Sports King. Let's have Pino give it a try. Oh, also, we're now able to go to the pier. Let's take a stroll down there sometime. That is a fantastic idea. And good morning, Pino. But first, let's go ahead and save it. No, that's not okay. Alright, so, let's just see how Pino does without any help from us in these sports events. And I guess we go to the racetrack to... to try out or whatever. Compete. Joshua, let's watch how Pino does. The foot race will now begin. All participants, line up. Well, going to give it a shot? You bet. Here I am. Come on, louder! You can do better than that! Hmm, what do we have here? A human boy! This is unusual. This contest itself is a great idea and all, but Gijin just go around winning everything, so it's gotten silly. Humans don't even bother to participate anymore. Of course, I can't blame them, really, facing mechanical men as opponents. Well, boy, will you show those Gijin a thing or two for us? I'm getting so sick of the way things are now. Well, now explain the foot race. The rules are simple. You'll run as a group of four. Whoever reaches the end first wins! But your opponents are all Gijins, so you'll need a lot of power to win. If you score first place, you'll receive prize money and a trophy. Alright, well let's see how Pino does. Ready, set, go! Well, as you might expect, he's trailing pretty far behind here. Yeah, there's <laughs> no hope of winning this race. Wow, a whole four seconds behind. That did not go well. Let's see how he does in the next event. The shot put contest will now begin. All participants line up. Well, going to give it a shot? You bet. Here I am. Come on, louder, you can do better than that. This woman might actually stand a chance at. I will now explain the shot put. The rules are simple. Throw the ball as far as you can. Currently, the top three records are all held by Gijin. If you can make a new record, you'll receive prize money and a trophy. Yeah, this one we should do alright at. Take that! Hey, we actually came in first. You did it! Congratulations! Here's your prize! 5,000 Corlo and a trophy! Love the trophy delivered to your house! Alright! We sure showed those Gijin! Yahoo! Woohoo! Alright, you're showing off your redneckness there. Okay, you can stop firing the gun now. Man, how much ammo do you have? There we go. Congratulations, Pino! The trophy's arrived, so I had it placed on the bookshelf on the second floor. 
keep up the hard work and aim for the title of Sports King. Alright, well, let's see the other events, see how we do with them. Now, obviously, if you're on a limited budget and you're trying to uh, meet the day requirement, she wouldn't be just jumping straight into the events like I am. You would already know what you need to do and you'd be going through the steps to do good at them. The hole in one contest will now begin. All participants line up. Well, going to give it a shot? You bet. Here I am. Come on, louder! You can do better than that! We'll now explain the hole-in-one contest. The rules are simple. All you have to do is hit the ball into the hole with the golf club. If you get it in, you'll receive a prize, money, and a trophy. And he doesn't even know how to use the golf club. So, that didn't go well. What do we have last? The free kick contest will now begin. All participants line up. Oh, going to give it a shot? Sure, why not? Here I am. Come on, louder! You can do better than that. We'll now explain the free kick contest. The rules are simple. Ball past the goalkeeper into the goal. You'll have five chances. Get it in three times and you win. Win, you'll receive prize money and a trophy. Sounds simple enough. Begin! And he does not know how to kick the ball. Now he does. Um, I'm afraid you need to at least kick the ball. Well, he might do better on that next time, but that's actually all the events for the day. Today's contest is over. Come back again tomorrow. So yep, you only get one shot at each event per day. <coughs> well, since we can't try those anymore, let's head on down to the pier. I'll go ahead and run here just to get past the screen faster. Joshua, let's watch how Pino does. Hello. Hey, you know, smoking is bad for you. <laughs> I need feeling an expression in order to use this. I figured it out. Boy, if you haven't any business here, then be on your way. Huh. That could have gone better. Let's try that one more time. Now that he actually knows what to do with the trumpet. Oh, I guess he doesn't know what to do with it. Never mind. Alright, well, we've got our work cut out for us here. So let's go to the shop. Alright, let's see... Um... I will need an encyclopedia eventually. So I'll go ahead and buy that. I will need a trumpet. Buy a couple of A chargers here. Let's make up for the fact that I pretty much wasted my energy today. You can hold two at a time. Or actually, I guess right now I can only hold one at a time. Never mind. 
normally you can hold two at a time. And I want a golf club. Oh, and I want this treasure box. And <clears throat> I reckon I'll do it. There's a soccer ball there, but I do not need it. And I will show you guys why I do not need it. We are going to a special place to train for the sports event. The Corlo Forest. And wouldn't you know it, here in the forest, we have a place to balance. And a soccer ball! Hey, that was a good job. Oh, but you already know what to do with the soccer ball, right? Uh, let's teach you what to do with the golf club. That is not what you want to do. There you go, Pino. Try doing it right. Alrighty. That's good. And he's figured out the golf ball. Now, let's see if he can figure out the trumpet. Yes, it does make a whistling sound. But I guess that's all he's going to do until his expression goes up. So, we've got some training ahead of us. We need to max out our light power and balance. And we need to max out our expression and our feeling. But, let's uh, go ahead and see what else is over here. You can actually take this soccer ball and keep it yourself. There's another hoe. Turtle Rock. No, that's not what you want to do there. Now this doesn't come into play until a little later, but uh, it's good to do it now because you can raise your luck stat. If you do this, but you want to teach him to start praying to the turtle. That is not what you're supposed to do. Pray to the turtle. I guess he's not going to do it until he's got more feeling. So, I guess I will end this episode off here, and uh, train up his stats. Um, the way you want to build up a leg power is with his uh, soccer ball. You can build up feeling and expression by repeatedly using the trumpet. And I believe the golf club will do balance. Let's just see. So it raises arm power, balance, and lowers reasoning. Now let's see. Uh, balance is at 13. So let's see just how good it is. So two energy, we raise balance by one. Alternatively, you can raise his balance by jumping on the log bridge, but it's going to use more energy. 
And if his leg strength isn't high enough, he can't even get up there. But anyways, like I said, I'm gonna end this episode off and, uh, do some training in between, just to get those stats up there. And I will see you guys next time. This has been Let's Play Wonder Project J, Mechanical Boy Kino. I am Flymadger, and I will see you guys then.